We'll do a battle of the shampoos to see which one comes out on top. We have Muru Muru and Avita. Hello everyone, my name is Sandra. This is Isabella. And welcome to my channel. Yeah. All right, y'all. So I ordered the mystery bag by Ipsy and they finally came in the mail. This is what it's looking like when, oh, it's outside of the bag. It's all outside of the bag. I thought it was gonna be in the bag. This one's the same way, it's not in the bag. This is the bag. It's super glittery and pretty. You like this one? You like this one? It's the sparkle sparkle. I'm just not gonna look and I'm gonna put these things into the bag. These won't fit, so I'm gonna have to leave those out of the bag. For my first mystery bag, the first item in here is a carrot ginger salicylic acid pore cleanser. That's actually pretty cool. I'm actually very happy to get more cleansers just cause you never know. You might find like a cleanser that is better than the cleansers you've been using and then you switch over. This is what it looks like. I love this orange. This is by Sweet Chef. That's the brand. Hopefully it has a cute little scent to it. It doesn't really have a scent to it. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this off of my arm really quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are you ready to go to the dada? She's getting fussy, so I'm gonna go ahead and take her down to her dada. Baby girl is downstairs with her dada. <laughs> and we're gonna get back into this mystery box. I have the ginger vitamin C oil-free moisturizer. Gel moisturizer. <laughs> this is to hydrate, smooth, and brighten. I got a lot of stuff with vitamin C. It's like they read in my mind. How do they know that I need vitamin C stuff? I guess I could use this after I use this. So, ooh, look at what that comes in. That's so cool. This is different. I've never seen anything like this. This is what it's looking like. It's cute. Ooh, that one actually is like squirted out fast. The other ones, I'd be pumping for days. Oh. <laughs> a little of my nose. I mean, it's skincare, so I can rub it into my nose anyway. Ooh, it actually feels good. And it has like a pleasant scent. Like it's not overly scented, but it just is pleasant. You know what I mean? First, I got this little duo right here. These go hand in hand, okay, by Sweet Chef. So far, we're off to a really good start. Now I'm gonna go ahead and reach into my bag, okay? And see what we got here. Oh, ooh, okay. So we got a nice little brush. This is nice. I actually do need more brushes because I don't buy brushes. I bought a few little brushes and then I haven't bought any since. It's just a little brush. It's so pretty. Got the little rhinestones, very girly. It's a powder RO3. It looks like an SL Miss Glam. It's cute, okay? It's fluffy. I don't know what this is for. It's definitely not for your eyes, it's too big. Maybe this is for like blush. Oh wait, it says powder. So it's for, it's like I didn't read it like literally five seconds ago. <laughs> it's a powder brush. It's so girly, I like this. Okay, okay, we still, we still hitting. It looks like I have a nail file. This is a glass nail file by Deco Beauty. It comes with a little cute little case so you can keep it in so you're not just leaving it laying willy nilly. This is a cute little glass nail file. I've always wanted a glass nail file, but I never actually went through the process of getting one. So it's this cute little pink. No, that's not pink. I just got pink on the brain. This is blue, okay? This cute little blue nail file. Actually, I got... It works. It does its thug dizzle. I see this as another hit, and I like it's got like a little case. The last thing in this box, and by the way, these glitters are definitely coming off. It's not as bad as I thought it would be, but the glitter is definitely coming off. The last thing in this mystery box is the Berries and Cream Dreams Velvet Eyeshadow. Ooh, okay. It is by Violet Voss. This is definitely worth the monies. I, I can already tell, cause I got like a whole skincare thing and I got the brush and then I got a freaking eyeshadow palette and the nail file. Like, ooh, it feels so good. Like, it just feels nice. This is what it looks like. Hopefully these colors are pretty, okay? Colors I would wear, cause then it's worthless if I'm not gonna wear it. This is what she's looking like. Yeah, those are definitely colors I will wear. Let's try a few of these out and see how they perform. I'm gonna take the lightest, the darkest, and a shimmer. 
to see how in a brown because sometimes the browns don't be they don't be brown okay they be just powder and then they just disappear so i'm gonna go ahead and take berry berry land Ooh, it feels really soft and creamy okay let's see it shows up, it shows up. It's a little powdery, but it shows up. It's not bad. Use that as like a transition. Next, I'm gonna try this brown here. It doesn't look brown on the camera. It looks like a like beige purple. This is Muted Mulberry. Look at that, that's pretty. It shows up and maybe it's buildable. Let me try it, let me go into it again and see if it builds. Yeah, it seems to build up really well. So that's good. So far, so good. Now let's go into the darkest color on here, which is Glamberry. All right, there she is. And let's see, that is pretty. This is a little powdery, so if you're gonna use it, make sure you tap your brush so you don't get powder all over your face. Last but not least, let's try one of these shimmers. I'm not gonna lie, I'm most excited about this Berry Champagne, this color right here. So I'm gonna try that one. Ooh, I like that. Now hopefully it shows up on the skin really well. Okay, yeah, that's pretty. Oh yeah, that's pretty. That's unicorn. I love it. Bam. So yeah, we hitting. We, this whole bag, this whole bag was a hit. I'm gonna go ahead and wash some of this stuff off my fingers, and dirty fingers. And then I'm gonna get into this glam bag. Look at how pretty that is. It's got like the cute little bat. I actually really like this and it feels so smooth. I like the little bat and I like that it's got the lace and the lace looks like little bats. So this is cute. Let's see what's in my little man bag. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I've never heard of it before. There's that. Okay, it's so itty bitty. Let's see if it smells good. Hmm, it smells, it smells like a candy that I've had before. Let me see. It actually doesn't smell bad. Like it smells like spicy and sweet. I don't know, but it smells really good. Like it smells like a candle. You know, it smells like one of those candles that you get from like Yankee Candle around autumn time. But this actually smells really freaking good. Oh, I like that. I like that. I gotta see if Justin likes it. And you know, if he doesn't like it, then I can't wear it, you know? Cause it's like, I wanna smell good for my man. So if it's not smelling good for my man, why would I wear it? The next thing is Shades by Shan. This is what she's looking like. It's like a little lip gloss. Ooh, that don't smell good. <laughs> It smells like a chemical. It doesn't smell like sweet or anything. It just smells like a chemical. But let's see how, how she looks on my crusty, dusty lips. I've been exfoliating y'all, but I guess it just takes time. It doesn't pick up that much product when you go in. I guess it's just like a lip gloss. It doesn't really leave much of a color. It feels good though. I'm not even gonna hold you. It feels a little waxy, but in a good way. You know, like not sticky where it's like, you feel like you're gonna get the little strings, but it just feels good where like you can talk without feeling like weird, you know? Like your lips don't stick together. I actually like that. This is nice, okay. Everything I've opened today has been really good. I'm super excited. All right, the next thing is a itty bitty little Squeezy tube. This is a Balance Me AHA Glow Mask. So one use, <laughs> you can get one use out of this itty bitty little squeezy tube. It's 0.34 fluid ounces, a triple action chemical exfoliation mask with skin brightening fruit acids to deeply purify plump and reveal natural, more youthful, luminous glow in less than 15 minutes. I'm gonna have to try that another time. Cause like it left a little film, a little layer of film over the top and I don't have anything with me that's small enough to kind of like break through that. So I'm gonna have to try that at a later time. The next thing in here is a Honey Bee Paraben and Sulfate Free Unwind and Hydrate Body Lotion. I like this little packaging, it's so cute and purple. And this is by Haiku Skincare. So it's just a little lotion. Honestly, I'm just gonna put this right in my purse. <laughs> Let's see what she squeezed out like. Ooh. It has a smell to it, it's very subtle. It smells good. I don't know what that smell is, but it smells really good. It rubs into the skin really good. My hand feels nice and soft. I like this, this will go right in my purse. The next thing is Avita Nutri, Nutri Plenish Shampoo. It's a little, little thing of shampoo. When I'm done using my Muru Muru, I will try this one and see. Ooh, it actually smells pretty good. I am in the market for new shampoos, so we'll do a battle of the shampoos to see which one comes out on top. We have Muru Muru, 
and Avita. I mean, it's just a shampoo. What else do you want me to say? I'm not gonna rub it into my skin. <laughs> no, thank you. I think that's it. That was it in that tiny itty bitty little bag. So that was all my stuff. Obviously the bigger bag was more exciting for me, but these things are actually pretty nice. I'm not, I'm not, tripping. I wish they put like the sister conditioner in the bag with this. I think that would have been very helpful because you know, usually you do the shampoo and the conditioner. So now I have to use the shampoo and find another conditioner that'll hopefully complement this. But I mean, beggars can't be choosers. If the price of this scent isn't too bad, if it's not gonna make me gag, then I might actually buy this fragrance if Justin likes it. Cause I like this. This smells so freaking good. Like I'm actually, let me just, those were my two little mystery bags. I'm not gonna lie, I really like them. I actually really like them. I know some people were complaining about the bags, but me personally, they were hidden. If you like this content, you already know what to do. Like, share, comment, and definitely subscribe so you can become a Fae Bay. I will see y'all with the next one. Deuces.